I stood corrected yesterday because I said West Westbrook had uh, got traded to Minnesota. It's actually to Utah, and I appreciate the the uh, reader pointing it out. Bottom line, the Lakers got rid of him. But let me tell you something. I'm not even the biggest Russell Westbrook fan like that, but his energy and what he does, it has its place. You know, now I've always said that he plays 21, 5 on 5, but the NBA does reward stat patterns and do reward a certain style. He is almost considered like an Allen Iverson type for his era, even though I think that's not fair to AI because AI did lead his team to the finals and AI just never had help. But AI, you know, he, he came up big. But I'm going to say this about Russell Westbrook. He's been disrespected by the media, by the Lakers, by a whole lot. The calling of that man West Brick, I mean, it was comical. He hit some bricks. He stunk his first early part with the Lakers last year, but he wasn't the reason why they stunk. Just like this year, he come off the bench as a six man. Frank Vogel said, do it. Frank Vogel got fired. How do you fire a man who, who won you a ring and got you to postseason or what have you? And the late, I don't understand it. No, no diss to Devin Ham, the, uh, the, uh, the Ham, Coach Ham, the Lakers, but Frank Vogel made all the same suggestions with a better, with a situation that was more cohesive than what they've gotten. Well, so Westbrook ain't the Lakers problem. The elephant in the room is Anthony Davis because he can't stay healthy and he's supposed to be the next. And like I said, as great as LeBron James and play and he broke the scoring record, he should not be your best player at this stage. They don't have an identity. They don't have a true number one. They're hoping that a man that is still great, but really on borrowed time, can motivate and create. Anthony Davis ain't getting the job done. So, Russell Westbrook been the scapegoat. He been the one that's been labeled. He played good this year in his role off of six man. They even said probably six man a year. Why they want him run out the league? Run him out like they're doing Carmelo Anthony? It, um, it makes me feel for Russell Westbrook. And that's somebody that I usually don't even, I usually didn't clap for like that. However, the scapegoating of him the way they did him, especially LeBron, and that diva tendencies and Anthony Davis and all that acting they did, uh, it's not his fault that they just not a good team. Yeah, they picked up some pieces, but they're not a championship team. So stop with all the media slurping of LeBron and all that. He's like in Tom Brady's boat. He's older, and he can't get away with what he got away with five, six years ago. Because even though the mediocrity and everybody's close, well, think about it. If he was half as good as he was in terms of motivating getting it over, this team would be in the third slot. Because the West, once you get after Memphis, everybody's just bunched up like a sardine in a can. So really, it ain't happening. And you got two guys. This doesn't even come to Westbrook. You have two guys who are premier all-stars and what have you, and you're not motivating, you're not getting the job done, and you're under 500 mediocrity. That looks at Anthony Davis. That's the one that's the real problem. But Russell Westbrook, for all his flaws and the way he plays sometimes and how he comes up, wasn't the problem with the Lakers. He isn't toxic. It's just that they don't have the leadership and they don't have what they really wanted, another wheel to compliment. And they made a lot of moves by LeBron crying and pouting and mounting. And Anthony Davis has been the one who has not delivered. That's the real problem. Please hit like, subscribe, welcome thoughts and comments. And I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands, keep your mind clear, watch out for another shit of it if you want to. And again, it ain't Russell Westbrook's fault that the Lakers stink. You can find fault with him, but their problems start with your main two guys. I'm out.